This is Salmon Creek near Interstate 5 in Clark County, Washington. And we're going to be doing some field herping today and we're looking for Ordinoides, Northwestern Garter Snake, and Stemnesis Consinus, or Sertalis Consinus, Oregon Red Spotted Garter Snake. There's plenty of them out here and they're very large. So let's go see what we can find. Okay, after a little bit of hiking, we're about to come upon one of my favorite spots for Consinus, Oregon Red Spot Garter Snakes. Uh, it's a small shallow pool with lots of small bull bullfrogs, which is an invasive species. However, where you find those, lots of small bullfrogs, you will also find Consinus, Oregon Red Spot Garters. Okay. Today I'm not seeing any bullfrogs at all. Oh well, my luck. Oh, small one hiding in the water, water there. Okay. We're gonna go down around the pond here and go to the other side and see what we can find over there. Uh, this spot right here. I'm zooming there. On the other side is where I spotted a. Oregon red spot garter that was over three feet a few days ago. Well, yesterday. <laughs> okay, we're going to go check it out. Okay, I wanted to show you something. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it with this camera or not, but there are tiny fish in here. And now they've disappeared. Dang it. I, I recorded them earlier, a few minutes ago, and my battery died before I could save it, so that kind of sucks, but, yeah, there's fingerling salmon in here, little tiny ones, and this isn't cut, quite cut off in the creek yet, but it soon will be, and there's people that come out and scoop them up, raise them in pens, and until they're large enough, and then they put them back in the creek. Uh, I keep missing the bullfrogs, I'm trying to... They squeak and then hop into the water every time I'm not recording. Let's see what see what happens here. Oop, dang it. One just hopped in here. Looks like I've already disturbed every one of them. Didn't get a single one on camera. There's the main creek right there. I don't see any snakes either. That's weird. Oh well. I keep missing it. Oop. Bullfrogs. They're quick little buggers. And camera shy, apparently. <laughs> this is all invasive canary grass, which is really bad for the wetlands. Snakes don't seem to like it much either, believe it or not. They tend to stay out of it in more, more open areas. It's small shallow pools like this after a wet spring which is ideal for consinus because there's a lot of frogs in here and it's ideal hunting grounds. There's even a couple of small, some small salmon in here. I don't know if you can see them. Probably not. This is not an HD camera, that's for sure. 
Okay, after some more hiking, I've come to my favorite spot, and it's the only spot I know uh, left in Clark County where you can still see pond turtles. There's both western pond turtles and non-native sliders. I don't know if you can see them, but they're on the other side of the shore there. There's usually some baby ones right here on this shore. On the There's a log here. There they are. There they are. Those are two baby western pond turtles. Oh, one baby western pond turtle. On the log. This guy isn't too happy. <laughs> yeah, he's not happy. Okay, we're coming up on a very elusive species. They like Salmon Creek, too. Homo sapiens. 